Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can make your very own custom Discord server tags where you can literally name it whatever you want and change it the way you like it for your profile. Let's get right into it. The first thing I did was created a new Discord account. As you can see, no friends, no DMs, absolutely nothing. If you see, I even have the option to get Discord Nitro, so you don't need to have Nitro for this method. And then if you look on the side, you can see I've created a whole bunch of Discord servers, and this is key because what we're looking for is that server boosts badge channel at the top. Luckily, I managed to create a server, which then gave me that privilege. You can see I have under additional perks, server tags, and enhanced roles. We're focusing on server tags. You can see in order to enable that, you need three boosts. And Discord charges $14 a month just for three boosts, which is absolutely ridiculous. Thankfully, I have a quick and super cheap fix to this. If you head on over to my server boosting site, High End Boosts, you can see we sell two server boosts for one month for $2.30. That means you'll need to buy at least four for $4.60, way cheaper than Discord. But if you did decide that you did want to turn this into a legitimate server and unlock level three perks, we also do sell 14 server boosts for one month at an extremely affordable price at $13.99. Anyways, let's get back into it. Server tags cost three boosts to enable. You can see we currently have none. There's zero available, zero spent, and zero total. So we're going to quickly add three boosts and unlock server tags. I'm going to create a server invite. Head on back to high-end boosts and then click two server boosts, but we're going to buy two bunches of them. So four boosts, check out. And then instantly you can see we have gained four boosts and we've unlocked level one. It does say we have two boosts available. Two boosts have been spent for a total of four boosts. This is not good because like I said, you need at least three to unlock server tags. So what we're going to end up doing is we're going to go to disable level one. It's going to warn you and then disable it. Now you're back to four server boosts. Perfect, because now you can go down to enable under server tags. It says server tags have been enabled. Click configure. And then now you have to enable server tags. Once you enable it, now there you go. You can create your very own personal server tag that you can attach to your profile. Now you can name this quite literally whatever you'd like. I'm going to name it sub just like you should subscribe to the channel. Was that smooth? I think that was smooth. Not sure. After that, you're going to want to click save changes. And then after that, click adopt tag. And then the tag will be applied to my profile. And then you can see sub is on my profile, meaning anyone can click on it and see what server it's associated with. 